Welcome to another episode of the Blues Harp Biker. Well, hey, all right. Welcome to the Blues Harp Biker channel. I'm the Blues Harp Biker. My name is John, and I uh, do all kinds of fun stuff here. Uh, music, motorcycles, motorcycles, music. What else is there? I don't know if there's much else in my life, but anyways, you're here and thank you for being here. And if you're a return watcher, I really appreciate you coming back. All right. Well, um, today I'm going to head over to Herwald Motorsports. We're going to go out and ride some BMWs. Uh, they're having demo truck, the BMW demo truck over there. I frequent the demo trucks whenever I see them. As you can see, I've got a few videos about demo trucks. So we're going to go ride some BMWs. I'm not going to ride the R18 because I've already ridden it. Go back and check it out. It's a episode about, oh, maybe a year ago. Um, a while back, I did a ride on a on a uh, R18, the big BMW. So, But I'm going to go out and ride a couple others and uh, have a good time. Uh, see what they're all about. You'll get my review on it. Um, but I'd also like to ask you, uh, if you haven't yet, or if you are a new subs new watcher, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Hit that subscribe button, and also give me that thumbs up, and also hit that little bell. Now that thumbs up, that lets YouTube know you like what I'm doing, and it makes me feel good about things. And also that bell will let you know when I upload new content, which is every Tuesday, every Saturday, 9 a.m. I try to make it every Tuesday, every Saturday at 9 a.m. Pacific time, but uh, sometimes I mess up. But anyway, um, and hit that subscribe button. That subscribe button just lets me know that uh, you're on my side and we're together in this deal. So um, if you could, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for me. All right, well, I'm going to fire up the Harley. I'm going to take the Soft Tail Deluxe today and uh, head on over to the BMW Demo Days event and uh, they got the demo truck and ride some BMWs, huh? Um, yeah, get on some dad bikes and you know, let everybody know that I'm a dad. <laughs> I'm of age, I'm of age for that. Anyways, let's go, let's rock and roll and uh, next stop, Herwald Motorsports. All right, let's do it. We're here in Herwald Motorsports right now, getting ready to go on the BMW demo ride. I'm just checking out the showroom here. And, uh, we're getting ready to go, man. All right, let's go out and see what's happening out here. All right. Oh, wow, look at this. 18 it's all duded up so they've decided not to they've decided to move away from just the plain black Right, well what we got is a group ride so we're gonna wait around for the group to get back and uh, it's about a 20 minute group ride so it's not like the uh, Indian event and the uh, Triumph event where you can just go on your own so but that's okay you know it'll be uh, it'll uh, give us some way to something to do you know some way to just follow the leader I don't have to think about where we're going, you know, let somebody else do the thinking. But uh, anyways, as soon as they get 
back here and they get ready to go again, we're going to ride. So let's do it. the demo ride right here. Downship off the throttle. Off the throttle, downship on the throttle. Okay, so this is what we're riding today, the R1250R. Yeah. 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 Rainbows on the front. Very nice. Okay. All right. Well, let's get on it and go. Looks like it started pretty good. Started right up. doesn't really give you that torque like a R18 or the older BMWs do. All right, so here's our turn signals here just like everything else. Menu, let's move. We got to we're going to roll. All right. Got to see what's happening here. Hopefully it'll be possible to get a idea on how this bike stops and rides and stuff. Stops really good from a slow standpoint anyways. I can't tell what this guy's doing. Okay, let's go. Okay, dude gonna go. This dude's got some get up and go right here. I'm gonna say it again, I hate these kind of turn signals. You're very smooth stopper. It's got like about a, I believe that this R1250 has like 134 horsepower and 105 foot-pounds of torque. And I can feel the torque. It's got some torque. See that? Woo, man. And 
it only weighs like 500 and something pounds. So it's kind of a beast. It's really, really, really light. <clears throat> crazy about the mirrors turns real nice it's got a nice second gear nice third gear Oh, this bike will go. Nice. I feel pretty comfortable on it. like the brakes Pretty sweet. This is a dad bike. I feel like I really feel like a dad today. <laughs> this would be a great bike to take on the Father's Day ride. <laughs> you can always tell the Harley guys they always want to rev their motors at the stop sign. <laughs> That's me. Oh. I'd sure like to give this baby some gas. Maybe they'll take us on the freeway. Because it Feels like it's got a lot of a lot of potential on the freeway. And the riding position is actually not too bad. It's kind of high. I would have liked the I'd like the handlebars to be a little higher. <clears throat> but it's not bad. I was worried about, I always worry about mid controls because mid controls are my legs are long and they they make my hips ache. I've got bad hips, so someday that'll all change when I get my hips done, but but this is nice, it's nice, and, and you sit back far enough from this wide gas tank to where it doesn't feel so wide.
but it's like a oh I don't know how to say it right but it's like it's got a very even disbursement of the power so when you give it the gas it just you really can uh, oh how do I explain it you can really judge well by the gas you give it on how fast you're gonna go and how you know ah, it's hard to explain I feel it though it's just everything feels very even I personally would like to see this a little bit higher right about there it might not look as cool but it would be a lot fun more functional you can feel the torque man seat doesn't feel too bad What I said about that power, the disbursement of power, it just very easily made its way up to 80 miles an hour here. And it just did it with no effort whatsoever. It didn't even feel like the motorcycle was, and, it, and it's not, it doesn't feel like a, you know, like a super fast bike. But it's pretty fast. It's just everything is really smooth, you know? And it got up the speed real easy. If any of that makes any sense. Watch out for that guy. Everybody slowed down. <laughs> So when I'm going, you know, 70, 80, 75, 80 miles an hour on my Harley, I can feel it. And this thing, you, you can't really feel it. A gang of dad bikers. Oops. Getting a little too far over in this lane. We're supposed to ride staggered. It's a very, very interesting motorcycle. It feels like a very safe motorcycle. But I mean, it'll, it'll go. And the suspension is really nice on this too. And man, we'll stop. We'll, we'll stop. We'll stop on a dime. Look at that. Whew. The 
this is a really really cool thing there you go What a cool bike. This was a really cool bike. It's, um, like I said, it, 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 it feels like a very safe motorcycle. And in safe, I mean, it's just safe. It doesn't, you know, it doesn't feel like a monster. But this bike's got all kinds of power. And all kinds of torque and it's real deceiving Yeah. This is a really, really nice bike. Really nice highway bike. And it's cool for... It, I, I think you could buzz around town in it real nice, too. Because it's really light. And it's got all kinds of pep. You know, like I said... It's, 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 everything is real even on it, you know, you give it the gas and it just, it kind of like, whatever you think you want it to do, it does it real easy. Shifts real uh, easy and smooth and, you know, turns real nice, stops real nice. that's it all right excellent I give it a thumbs up
right, that's a wrap. I'm back home now. And uh, great ride on the uh, BMW R1250R. Um, yeah, it's a great bike. Good time riding it. Yeah, I can't think of anything really I didn't like about it. You know, um, good bike. So check one out sometime. You know, if you're uh, a BMW person or, you know, you're not a Harley guy, like I always say when I ride bikes that aren't Harleys, uh, check it out. I really had a good time. You know, it's really hard for me to find things wrong with stuff. Um, I didn't, you know, when I, I really like to ride motorcycles, so everything that I uh, ride, I have a good time doing. And that was a good time. Uh, so check it out. The BMW R1200R and a very cool bike fast little dude really cool really cool really good time so anyways if you guys had a good time uh, hit my subscribe button there and then hit that thumbs up and then hit that little bell all those things are good things uh, the thumbs up let's Facebook know you like me subscribe makes me happy and of course the little bell lets you know when uh, I do something again that way you can watch again every Tuesday, every Saturday, right here on YouTube at 9 a.m. Pacific time. All right, it's the Blues Hard Biker signing out now. Thanks a lot, everybody, for tuning in. I really do appreciate you. Hope uh, you guys uh, had a good time on the BMW today, and uh, we'll see you next time. All right, thank you. Be safe, ride safe, be cool, have a good time, take care of each other, be nice to people. If you do all those things, man, you can't miss. All right, have a good one.